Let's do one more level. See what we get. Here we go. We're testing the Ridgeway Pride build I just made. Oh, we'll go through this. I'll show you the build at the end. Okay. Here we go. <laughs> I knew it. We sh share the wealth a little bit like that. this guy going? Agents requesting backup. There you go. Oh, damn it. Oh, let's keep running. Turn the memorial into a base. There's an area beneath you with increased security. It is a fairly decent build. Stay alert. I don't know where you walk in. Learn how to play with it, you know, it's um With Bloodsucker and this, I think it's working out pretty well. DC-62, detected. Heads up. Isaac just ID'd those shells as chemical weapons. You know what? Can't afford to let the true sons escape with those. You've got to find a way to... My lady death would do. Let's put that on. Oh, I like the other gun better. Yeah, I like that gun better. Yeah, the RPM's crazy on this gun. Bitch. Above me. Target's moving around us. Where did he go? Where did he go? Yeah. Hmm. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, this gun is a lot better than Lady Death for this scenario. Seems to hit harder and melting them, putting them down pretty quick. According to the schematics Isaac pulled upstairs, we can lock that tunnel door from their control center. That should keep them from being able to transport those mortars loaded with DC-62. <laughs> get everybody bleeding, get a little armor going, get down tonight, mm -mm -mm -mm, get down tonight. I don't think this guy knows what he's getting into. Oh. Ooh. This guy's a great spot for a turret. They always say that, you know. Yeah, look at that armor belt up. Some crazy numbers, aren't they? Take this, motherfucker. These guys are everywhere, dude. They're like scattering like rats. And where's the last guy? There you go. Thank goodness. That's pretty good taking out that big armor. Oh. I don't know what you guys think, man. I don't know if I like this better than my True Patriot build or, you know, my um, exotic backpack build. It's kind of fun so far. Keep them from getting more of those mortars. And it, 
I mean, I could try some different guns, but I'm trying this Victor SBR 9mm. Good hit chance, good hit damage with Sadis on it. And we're sitting there at 60, 141. That's a lot of damage, dude. That's a lot of crit hit chance and 70% uh, headshot damage. Fascinated by that. Of course, I'm going to be an armor on kill too with this build. And Bloodsucker. Hmm. I don't know, the guy ran right by me, man. What the hell? You know, dude, seriously? Deploying turret. No, you're not. Oh, man, we're like way back here. This is not where I like to be. This is a place I like to be right here. Reload. With his backpack. Or gets down. Ah, uh, I did not do it. Here we go. What do you think of that, huh? Good work. Here we go. Go on ahead, back up. So oh, check out the build, man. The Running a Victor, which, be honest with you, I like it better than the Lady Death for this build. Um, secondary was Lady Death. I'm probably gonna try something else. Damage 83. That's not bad. You know, of course, we're running. Hunter's Fury, four pieces, and a couple of them with armor on it. And get that armor up to 1.1. Gives it a little bit more balance instead of just all damage. You've got to get some of that armor on kill percentage. Goes off that 1.1, right? And you no, know, you're looking at the Ridgeway's Pride chest piece, and you have that bleeding edge, which is also this is working off your armor number, okay? I'll pause it right there. You can read that. But Basically, your repair strength per number of bleeding enemies, right? So, you saw me spray a few times to get that repair strength going up a little bit higher. So, you get spray three of them is 12% per second. And then that's not bonus armor. That's armor when you're below armor. So, you got all that bonus armor. It's not going to really do much for you. Okay. So, again, um, on this fury, I'll show you the numbers real quick. Right. Right, then what we're running for a chest piece. We want a 10% SMG damage, 15% air, I'm a little bit low on crit hit damage, but crit hit chance, crit hit damage, and the bloodsucker. You saw the bloodsucker work, right? So with the bloodsucker and the ridge bro ridgeway, it's pretty interesting. I, I will definitely try this, you know, some different guns with it and see how it does, but you saw how hard it hit. Oh, I think that's pretty good. I think that pretty much covers it. Put that shield down. And, um, yeah, I think that's it, baby. That's a Ridgeway Pride build. Old school out.